So my morning routine looks like this. I wake up every morning at 5.30. The alarm goes off. I don't hit snooze. I drink my 30 ounces of water. I send out my three gratitude text messages to three people that I appreciate and I'm grateful for that morning. I'll get my coffee, my protein shake, and my water again, and I'll attack my get shit done list. Successful people plan their day the night before. If you just wake up and you let the day or your feelings determine your day, you're fucked. Every time I sit in, in, in an interview, it's, oh, why are you here? You have too much money, you're too successful, you've done it all, blah, blah, blah. You know, in the last fight, I kind of bought into that. You know, I was in the press conference and a guy was reading out a quote of mine from many years ago where I was like, you know, uh, talking about, I can't wait, I'm gonna, I'm gonna put my mother in a mansion, I'm gonna, you know, my girlfriend's gonna have a car for every day of the week. And, you know, I was feeding into that, wow, I did all this, you know, I, I, I'm not even, I'm, I'm where I am, I'm grateful, I'm proud of where I am and what I've achieved, but there's a lot more left in me. I'm still very young, I'm very fresh in the game, and I'm a dangerous man, Steve, and I'm the most dangerous of them all. You know what I mean? This, I have 19 knockouts in my mixed martial arts career. Saturday night I will get my 20th, it'll be my 12th UFC main event. Only 22 years of age, fresh, fresh as anything, I'm ready to go. So I'm gonna prove how dangerous I am, because trust me, in the mindset I'm in, I'm really, really dangerous. This man is not... It's not going to be pretty what's going to happen to this man in here. Mm. I became a millionaire at 23, and if I could give you three pieces of advice, it would be... Number one, don't buy dumb shit. Wait on the fancy car, wait on the fancy watch, and definitely don't buy luxury clothing items till you have at least $100,000 in savings or investment. Number two, spend your 20s building your skill set and your personal brand because that will be paramount to success later and make your life a lot easier. And number three, if you're gonna buy your first piece of real estate, don't make it a personal home. Buy a duplex or a quadplex and let the tenants pay your mortgage. You get the capital appreciation and you win in the long run. You gotta build in the future an experience that makes you emotional. You got to get behind the whole thought of something that you're going to experience in the future, not only for yourself, but the people that you love. And the more that you can imagine that, Albert Einstein said, imagination is what sets us human beings away from everything else on the planet. Imagination. And if you don't learn to take your imagination to experience something in the future for you or somebody that you love, you're never going to move forward.